Hey there everyone, Michael here, playing Emerald City Confidential. Alright Jack Pumpkinhead, we need to talk to you for reasons I've already forgotten. Hello again, Jack. Yeah, 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 what do you want? It's because he's a smuggler, right? Okay, here we go. Hey Jack, what do you know about Captain Bill? Bill who? Captain Bill, the one you're blackmailing to smuggle illegal magic items and pumpkins. Not this song and dance again. I have evidence and testimonies to back these up. Who from? That drunken Bill? Bill is just an innocent pawn in your smuggling ring. His only crime was caring for a young orphan. If you say so. I do say so, and I can prove it. I've got enough dirt on you to put you away. And this time, the mud will stick. So, Petra, I don't see any guards here to arrest me. What is it you want? Ansel, I know you sent him to Bill. Where is he? Look, I ain't admitting to anything, but the scarecrow might. What? I said the scarecrow might be the one you're looking for. Where can I find this scarecrow? Scarecrow? Did I say scarecrow? What's that supposed to mean? It means that's all you're getting from me. Okay, so I think we just blackmailed the blackmailer. Awesome. And that's all we're getting from him. See you later, Jack. The gump stand is that away. Feel free to use it. Find the scarecrow, find Ansel. Does the scarecrow know where Ansel is? That's the question. Alright, so I went off to find the scarecrow. Heh. <laughs> scarecrow. He might scare crows, but he doesn't scare me. I think he's just an odd-looking man. Hello again. Hello, odd-looking man. Greetings like a leaf on the wind. All right, buddy. Do you know anything about Angel? You wouldn't know anything about the Scarecrow, would you? The Scarecrow was once a ruler of Oz, but stepped down when the crown became too heavy. The Lady Ozma has done a much better job, and bears the weight much better than the Scarecrow ever could. Okay, so I'm gonna accuse this odd-looking man of being the Scarecrow. You are the Scarecrow. I am not who you seek. Look, shut up and listen for once. I can see the straw poking out of your clothes. There's only one man in all of Oz that looks like you. Are you the authority on what all men look like? Spare me the song and dance. What's a former ruler of Oz doing on my street corner? One must always keep an eye and ear out. So, you are the Scarecrow. Okay, we found the Scarecrow, but I don't think we found Ansel. You are correct. Jack Pumpkinhead sent Ansel to you. I need to find him. Anzo, do you mean the desperate man? I don't know. Was he desperate? The man you call Anzo was indeed desperate. So I sent him to the one last refuge of truly desperate men. And that is? Seek out the former Gnome King. Ruggedo? Why? My knowledge is past. I have nothing more to tell you. Good evening to you, and good luck. He sent me off to Ruggedo. I don't know why he sent me there. Somehow... This case just keeps getting more and more dangerous as I go along. So once again, I go back to Ruggedo's bar. There's General Ginger standing on the street. Should I talk to her? Should I not? Let's see. General Petra. Let me see. There's only one thing I can talk to her about. About that explosion. What about it? Let me see. Yeah, we already talked to her about all these things. Let's forget it. Let's talk about something else. I'd rather not talk at all. Okay, Gnome King. See you around. Yeah. Let's see if you know where Ansel is. Ah, Bill is gone. Nobody here but me, the candy, and the... Uh, uh, oh, I keep messing up on this detective voice. Evening, Ruggedo. Evening, Petra. I'm looking for someone. Can I ask you some questions about him? I'll do my best. You can stop pretending. I know he came here. Whoever do you mean? Ansel. The Scarecrow sent him. He told me himself. He did, did he? Yes. Well, all right. If you must know, Ansel is here in this room. Wait, wait, wait. What? Where is he? He's transformed. You probably noticed my new crystal decanter. Yes. That's your friend, Ansel. Ah, okay.
Okay. See, the Gnome King likes to transform people into things. That was the whole plot line at the end of Ozma of Oz. That would be the third Oz book. Yeah, that's right. What did he turn Ozma into? He turned her into something green because she's from the Emerald City. And so, I'm guessing the decanter... He's a decanter. Yes, I transformed him He's myself. green. I thought you lost all your magic powers. I did. I can't keep a single spell in my head. Fortunately, I have one written down. I can transform anyone into an ornament. Unfortunately, it only works with the victim's consent, so I can hardly use it to take over the city again. Why did Ansel consent to being transformed? He was on the run. Dangerous people were looking for him. It's the refuge of last resort, isn't it? All right, Gnome King, turn him back. Transform him back. I can't do that. Not unless he wants to. I don't care if he wants to. That's not the problem. The spell only works with the victim's consent, and he is content to remain the way he is. I need to talk to him. Can you speak ornament? No, I can't speak ornament. Would you like to? What do you mean? If I transform you, then you can talk to him. Okay, fine. Let's go along with this plot line. Transform me, then. I want to talk to him. Very well, just a moment. Whoa. I've got you now, gnome. Ginger, a pleasure as always. None of that. Magic definitely leaked out of this establishment. Please, I'm just an honest businessman. Don't you have real criminals to go after? You're the biggest criminal of them all, Rusto. You're coming with me. I'm not moving from this spot. I never said you had to. I'll talk to you at headquarters. Whoa! Take the fudge, Ginger. Now what am I supposed to do? <laughs> Who was that? Can't you guess? Hansel. Got it in one. I've been all over this city looking for you. Well, you found me. Pat yourself on the back. Alright, we just found Ansel, but now I'm a coat rack. Or a hat rack. I'm some kind of rack, and I don't know how to go back. At least she still has her cool looking hat. Oh, and the mirror. Yes, I think the mirror is part of the puzzle. Hello? Hello? Are you talking to me? Yes. Who are you? Oh, nobody. Just a mirror. Go away. Oh, no. Never mind. Okay, I'll talk to the mirror later. Now, let's talk with Ansel. You're a hard guy to find, Ansel. And yet, you managed. That's impressive, sweetheart. I'm impressed. I thought I had all the angles covered. I'd give you a kiss if I could. Yeah, and I'd give you a smack if I could. Look at her. I'm being threatened by a cobra. And I thought I'd seen everything. Yeah, come on. You're engaged to Dorothy. She hired me to find you. She is a sweet kid. I have some questions about her. When's the wedding? Wedding? She said you were engaged. Engaged? No. You got it all wrong, sugar. I'm not the married type. She was fun to hang around with for a while, but I've moved on. Why does she want to find you so bad? She wants to find me? She hired me to find you. She has a magical device that told her you were back in town. Oh, that magic picture of hers. I didn't think she'd use it to spy on me. <laughs> Clever girl. Doesn't the magic picture belong to Ozma? And doesn't it show you exactly where the person you're looking for is? Are you aware that Dee is Dorothy Gale? Oh, sure. She tried to hide it, but I... Poor little princess and all that. Living up in the royal palace with the ice queen. No wonder she wants to escape. Have a little fun once in a while. Let's talk about something else. You got it. Did he just call Ozma the ice queen? So, Ansel, I have some questions. Sure. Ask away. I'm an open book. No, you're a crystal decanter. Ah, semantics. Ah, clever dialogue right there. Why are you hiding? Hiding? Me? Nah. I'm a spy for the Emerald City Health and Safety Department. Please. I'm trying to help you out here. Look, when you're in a corner, there's no place else but Ruggedo's. Sure, he's a former tyrannical military despot, but he's sure helpful in a tight spot. Who is after you? Nobody who can find me now. Unless you squeal, but you wouldn't want to do that. The people after me are bad news. They'd probably do something to you as well. Who blew up Bill and Trot's ship? I'd tell you, but I can't. Get it? Can't? 
decant decanter i'm a decanter yeah i get it just answer my question don't think i'll be doing it let's just say i've got something they want even if they find me the object they want is in my pocket which sadly has been transformed along with the rest of it let's talk about something else sure i'm not going anywhere